All right, well, what do we got to do today? Everything. What's <laughs> everything? Building the house. We got to do some putting and some caulking. <laughs> Putting the rest of the rope up. Um, all right, so what we're going to work on today is she's going to work on putting all the nail holes in the fascia. And I'm going to work on getting the gable ends closed. No and, more wind in the house. Yeah, no more wind in the house. And sealing off a few other areas. And, uh, and that's that. Let's keep going. So the next thing we're going to do now, since we've got the, um, we just got a little bit of taping left to do. Joe's working on that, but obviously we got that in on both sides. Now we have to close off underneath the little patio for the porch here, the porch. So I'm going to start working on that. We're going to have to use temporary just some plywood because I only have one sheet of uh, the zip sheeting left but that'll that'll at least you know close it in so no critters no cats <sighs> all right I got the like the purlins up there that's all we're gonna be able to do for tonight out here we got a lot done though didn't we Jill yes we did all right. we got a lot done so what do you think's next for tomorrow I'm going to work. I don't know what you're going to do tomorrow. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to put the sheathing up oh, on here yeah. so the house is closed up. Sounds good. And then finish that last little bit of taping. I don't have to worry about you getting on those 80 foot ladders. Mm -hmm. the Wait, that's ladder. the inspectors here. Shit. Did you, did you cover up that electrical outlet? No, I didn't. I'm stuck in He's telling me we got to clean the trash up this unsafe work environment. <laughs> All right, well, we got the gable trim done. I just got a little bit of taping left to do up there. And uh, really what I was wanting to get done was closing off this patio here. Uh, as you can see, I just put um, plywood in there for now, but this will be all zip sheathing. But I did zip sheathing, sheathing around the ends because when we do the spray foam, I want to be able to take this out so they can get to it easily with the spray foam. So that's going to be, you know, a lip where it'll allow for the uh, amount of thickness of spray foam that we'll be using in that. Then we'll go ahead and zip sheet the rest of this up and then get, uh, you know, our finished product up there. All right, well, that's going to do it for uh, this episode of The Gable Ends. See you on the next video.
Oh, 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 oh,